would you watch your friend fuck? <laughs> We may have already done that. <laughs> so, who cares? Why not do your own thing and let them say what they want? What's up, guys? Today we're gonna be taking questions from Instagram. Every time I see her, I have to like finish her vape space. <laughs> yeah, but it's 0% nicotine. We some responsible hoes, that's what we are. You guys sent us questions on Instagram and um, we're gonna answer them. So, we haven't Stop. even read through them. We have not, no. This is my first time seeing them. And the first one is, have you ever injured someone during sex? For sure. For sure. Like mentally? <laughs> oh, definitely mentally. <laughs> have you ever scarred someone for life during sex? Injured? It makes it sound like, like injured is a, an accident. Oh, you're saying like you like beat someone like sexy wise. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I, I, I'll i slap a dude. I've slapped dudes during sex, but I injured, probably, I don't know. Had broken beds, there's no way someone wasn't injured in that. <laughs> From bouncing too much? Like the entire thing was like. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> it went sideways? <laughs> oh my God. Yeah, I knew. <laughs> I just bought my bed. <laughs> oh, it was your bed, it wasn't someone else's bed. That's sad. Have you injured someone? Maybe, have you injured your bed? Yes. Absolutely. Like his foot had to have gotten injured in that. Oh my God. I think I've like accidentally knocked people in the face. Oh, there was one time I was in, uh, like, oh, it's so stupid. Jay really likes high heels in bed. So like, I was like, oh, I'm gonna wear high heels. And I like stepped the fuck <laughs> on his like foot, like really <gasps> bad. And I was like, okay, I'm done with this. And, like, so yes, yes, I have, it sucked. And it like totally ruined the mood. Cause it hurt him? Like, was he like, ah. Yeah, he was like, what the fuck? And he was like in a like kind of a bad mood. I'm like, what is the worst sex position in your opinion? 69. Why don't you like 69? I don't I don't get to enjoy it. I'm always on top, you know what I mean? So it's like I'm having to hold myself up, suck a dick. He's trying to please me. Trying. <laughs> the operative word. And it never works. And that's the thing. Like if I could get pleased and that if someone were, were to please me in the 69 position, but it's never happened. So um, whenever someone's like, that's 69, I'm like, ugh. I never get to do 69, but when I have, it's been like fun. You're so little. <laughs> what? You kind of just like, you rest your like stomach slash tits and then you kind of like arch your back so your pussy's like not suffocating him, you know? Yeah. And then like, especially with a curved up dick, it's like, go straight down your throat and it's great. And like, I, I don't know, I just like sucking dick so much and if I can get like sucking dick while being pleasured, like that's like the best. I think it would be fun to have like a guy, guy, girl threesome, you know? Where like the guy's just like fucking you and you're just like sucking a dick. Yeah. I can't come while sucking dicks. I feel like I'm gonna bite a little bit, you know? I feel like I'm, I'm gonna get sloppy, I'm gonna bite or something because yeah. I'm like orgasm. It's too much, like, oh, right? You know, but like uh, right up until that point, I feel like it's good. I just don't do it that often. And I kinda, I kinda wanna like, I, I don't know. I think it's hard for guys to like. I'm like, I hate it. You're like, I wanna do that tonight. I wanna do it tonight. <laughs> I'll do it, why not? All right. What's your least favorite? Hello. I totally forgot the question. I thought it was like, do you like or dislike 69? Oh. I thought that was the question. Just me. I was like, I answered. And also 69 is my birthday. Oh shit. What's wrong with this guy? So people always like, expect it more out of me. <laughs> <laughs> no one's ever thought about that correlation once. Like literally never once. Only me. Yeah, you probably like bring it up if anything. I'm like, I know my birthday is 69, but I actually don't like it. Uh. First date. <laughs> like, um, what is the worst? Yo, like the pile driver. <laughs> I haven't done the pile driver in so many years, what is but that? I remember, dude, so like, you know, in the, the yoga position where you're like, I don't even know if I can do it on Please. this couch, but like, you fucking go like, uh, and like you stick your ass in the air, but your legs are on the floor, you know? Yeah, okay. Yeah, like, and then he fucks you, but I feel like you look so fat in that position, like no I matter that, who yeah. you are. Yeah, like, so it's like not cute, cause you're just like scrunching the shit out of your stomach and <laughs> All like- All of your skin's just- Yeah, weird. and like it feels so unsexy, you know? So it's like, it's kind of like hardcore a little bit or whatever, but it's really just a porn thing, you know? And like even the girls in porn, like just don't look that great in it, so. Yeah, okay, fair. I can get down with like any position I feel like. I feel like a lot of people would say missionary. I actually like missionary, depending, so I don't know. I do too. What's better, virgin plus virgin or virgin plus experienced? I think virgin plus virgin is cuter, like more romanticized. Like I would personally never fuck a virgin though. <gasps> I love virgins. Mm -mm. So, so you've never fucked a virgin, meaning like when you've never fucked a virgin. Mm -mm. Like the person who took your virginity wasn't a virgin. Mm -mm. You've never fucked a virgin. Mm -mm. Why? I don't know, should I? Why Why don't? Why would you never? I don't want someone that has no experience and that's like like messy, you know what I mean? One, they're probably gonna last like 20 seconds because it's their first time, you know what I mean? Yeah. As long as, I mean, I guess if they could go again, then, then it'd be okay. But then like, how do you, like, 
What made you wait so long? That's true. Yeah, I used to like them when I was younger, you know? Now it's like, what's wrong with you when you're like, why, yeah, like why mid having 20s, early 30s, it's like, a, and then like, even like, cause I like older guys usually. So it's like mid 30s, early 40s. Mm -hmm. Like, why are you a virgin? That's gross. But like, if you think about a younger guy and he's like 20 and he's like, he, he has like potential, and but he just hasn't realized it yet. He's kind of nerdy or something or like has no social skills. And then like, you just like blow his fucking mind. I think that's fun. I think it's fun to like blow a dude's mind. Cause you know what you're doing. Like, just like use him. And, and then fair. like tease him and it, but does it have to be a virgin can you just like have, have had sex like once almost every guy I feel like that I fucked like they're like oh yeah I fucked like a hundred dudes but they're like they haven't done anything they're like, basically virgins in my opinion you know like it's like there's so much to do and it's so fun to like show a dude like stuff that they haven't done so I feel like virgin and virgin is a disaster. Virgin and experienced is at least, you know, like if the experienced person is actually like patient and experienced, I think it could be fun. So that's my answer. Let's see. Straight or curved dick? Oh, I know your answer. <laughs> you know my answer. I agree with the answer. Yay! <laughs> the best answer. I feel like when you're like a straight dick is like can be pretty, like mm -hmm. really pretty. But like in terms of like application, it's it's it feels better curved. Yeah, because like you go in and like imagine like you're go okay so like you the G spot's like up here let's say and then you're going in but you're just like kind of going in so it's like grazing it a little bit but mm -hmm. like if you're going in at an angle you're like hitting That's, it yeah. like every thrust and that just like feels better so like depending on the curve up or down or whatever like sometimes you'll have to do doggy or missionary like shaped stuff to make it like really feel good but still even when it's not the head's not hitting the the G spot it's like the peak of the curve is hitting the G you know so it's like mm -hmm. always good it's always good curve dick ten out of ten. Curved dick, 10 out of 10. What is your guys' preferred dick size and shape? I don't actually know your preferred, so. You know what, I actually prefer like, how long do you think this is? Yo. I'm doing the crafty project. This is probably two inches, this is probably three inches. I think I'm gonna say like 5.5 or six. Uh -huh. I have a ruler. Not a measuring tape, it's a ruler. I have a ruler on hand, guys. All right, let's see, that's the wrong way. What? Four and a half inches? It's like that. Oh my god, I counted that with my thumbs. Did you? <laughs> Is that what you did while I was gone? I was like, one, two, oh three, my god. four. Yeah. Why didn't we do this with the hand earlier <laughs> when we were rating dick pics? Because the guy's hand, I swear that's why it was only three. I think 5.5, .5, honestly. Is 5 .5. my preferred. Wow, so average. Mm -hmm. See? They do exist. They do exist. Wow, okay, so give the reasons as to why because nobody believes me when I say like most girls do not give a fuck and they don't want like monster cocks like because I like to deep throat <laughs> <laughs> And I don't feel like suffocating and dying uh, every single time So if it's like something like that I actually prefer someone I date like that's what I prefer in their cock size So, so I can still have fun with it. I can still feel it. It's still good. Everything's good But like I can deep throat more comfortably than like a seven and a half, eight incher. What are the downfalls to a five and a half incher? Are there any, or is it like, you come great, everything's great? I come great, yeah, it's fine. <laughs> okay, so. You know, you just, the downfall of it is that you don't have an eight inch dick inside of you. <laughs> <laughs> so that's better then. No, I think I think the, the perspective of both, you know? Like you have a little bit of, like I'd, I'd rather have a little bit of eight inch and a lot of bit of ah. the average. Okay. So variety is good, and a big dick's not bad. I'm a whore. But, <laughs> but, but your your lifetime dick would be like an average-ish dick. Yeah, like if, if when I get married, I hope that will be his dick size. And then shape, what, describe the shape. The head shape, the shaft shape, like what's going on? I can show a picture. <laughs> you cannot show a picture. Not here. On Instagram. Let me show or you. YouTube. YouTube is what we're doing. This is just it. It's a little bit curved. You can't tell in this picture. Okay. Okay. So veiny, veiny, uh, penis shaped. Uh, penis shaped, a little bit curved. It's like good. It's it's got like the same thickness top to bottom. It's not like weird shaped mushroom thing or whatever. No, it's actually a little bit pointy at the top, which I wouldn't prefer. <laughs> oh really? So you want like the same? I want it. Yeah, pretty like all the way down. Okay. Yes. Yeah, same. The girth all the way down. Oh, it has to be girthy too. I care yeah. more about that than. Yeah, 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 like I, Size. I feel like a really long pencil dick is like not doing it. Mm -hmm. It just kind of like, it's pokey. Pokey. You pokey. <laughs> it's like literally pokey. It's not the best. Yes. I would, yeah, like I would lose a little bit of the size, a little bit of the length for uh, girth 
even mm-hmm. though I like lengthy dicks. So I, for me, I've told you guys this a million times, but whatever. It's like, it's like 6.5 to like eight or something would be like ideal. And I'll go for like monster cocks too. Cause I think that's like fun to be like filled up or whatever. Like it's like a cool feeling. So your preferred is there's a two inch difference. Yeah. Well, like anywhere in there, I like really don't care. Cause like, I want to feel like I'm being stretched out a little bit and that starts around like six, 6.5, but like six is like a little small. I don't know. So then like 6.5 is really good. And then seven point, I feel like 7.5. Okay. So like in the middle then like 7.5 would be ideal. Okay. And then like the curve, which is like a recent, I didn't know that I cared about that that much, but like, yes. So good. And then, um, yeah, just like shape all the way up. Like I don't, I don't like the really pointy, like where the head is tiny. And I fucking hate when the head is like gigantic and then like the shaft is smaller. Like that's fucking yeah. weird. Like I don't like the weird looking shit. I want like a, an aesthetic thing, fucking veins, just a good time. You know, it gets really, really hard, stays really, really hard, mm-hmm. all that stuff. Mm. The veins are important. The veins are important. I love veins. A lot of girls don't love veins. Is there a kink that you would like to try? I want to eat someone's butthole. She just wants to eat a butthole. Okay. Should we try it out? You That's... can eat my butthole. Does it have to be a guy? No. And there you go. Soon. Well, that was done. <laughs> we did it. For me, dude, I have a list of stuff. Like, oh, you know, I want to try role playing because I've knocked it for so long. Have you role played? No. Yeah, yeah, like, no. like I knock it because I'm like, it seems so fucking dumb. Like, like what kind of role play? I did the whole like whole like raper. There's raper Rapist. The, There's a rapist and I was a rapey. I don't know. But. Oh, I'm jealous. I love that. Yeah, I didn't know he was in my house. <laughs> so, Dude, that's amazing. Whoever was that for you? A bit is a scary. Fucking I got out of the shower in my black room. Like it was nighttime. Dude, I love this. I'm so jealous. No, like I'm one of them is I want to just like I want to like um be a secretary or something and tr- actually try that and like role play and be like, "Oh my god, here's your papers" and stuff like that. You know, I'm like cuz I I think it's so dumb and unnecessary, but like now I just want to try everything. So. That's fun. Uh, someone wants to see us lick each other's pussies and pee on each other's faces. <laughs> 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 YouTube things. <laughs> this is why my channel's not monetized. That's, that's why. Do cream pies turn you on? No. No? Indifferent. Indifferent. I used to hate them, and now I'm like... Now you like them? Does it turn you on? Yeah, because like, first of all, if it's a good load, you can like feel it, you know? Yeah. You can feel it on the walls, and that's kind of hot. And then like, I like... It, which is probably bad, but I like just like keeping it in me and letting it drip out and then, yeah. like walking around all day and being like, huh, I got jizzed in, like that's hot or whatever. But I used to be like, this is messy, this is annoying, I hate it. And like, why don't you just come on my face so I can visually see it or whatever. Honestly, I think I used to think the opposite. I used to like it. I used to like the feeling of it, but now like I can't, I can't feel anything. <laughs> what? <laughs> cum shots are not big enough. <laughs> I need more cum. Okay. She needs to put a ruler down. You are like crowding me. You're ruining the aesthetic of the video. Look at this shit. What is this? If I'm in the crevice or I'm not in the crevice then. <laughs> there we go. You are not in the crevice and I'm also not in the crevice. Do you like to have your toes sucked during sex? Oh my God, just happened the other day for the first time. Really? And did you like it? I told him he was a little aggressive with it because he used a little bit of teeth. Well, he teethed to the toes? Teethed to the toes. He was just like <laughs> <laughs> And I was like, oh, 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 oh. this is kind of a lot for me right now. It just oh sucked. Like, let's just start it with sucking. That was nice. It was nice. Mm-hmm. Supposedly, we have a nerve that is in the foot and then also in the pussy, and they like at a certain point like run together. So like supposedly women can actually like, get off on like feet shit, kind of. And I, I don't know. I've never really really explored that. So have I don't you know. had your toes sucked? I've had guys like suck my toes or kiss my feet or lick my feet, but it's like very brief. Mm-hmm. It's never like an event. So yeah, I, I don't know. Probably not, but I could be down with it. It's not anything that like turns me off or freaks me out or anything. It's just like, it's one of those things that like, if it turns him on, it turns me on, you know? Yeah. But like, it's not gonna be like, oh yeah, just keep doing that. Oh my God, you know, like probably not. I don't know, who knows? Any advice for someone who's never had sex? Uh, Have it. Have it. (laughs) That's what I always say, like get the sex. Like just have the sex. Do it. Advice, I don't know. In what in what capacity, you know, like to get I sex say, or act like you've had sex in your mind. Convince yourself you've had sex so the first time you have sex. It's like you're not insecure, you're not thinking about it, you're second guessing yourself whether you're performing well enough. Yeah. I thought like you've done this a thousand times. Yeah, confidence. Confidence will get you everywhere. Even always. if you have to fake confidence. Yes, fake it till you I make it. We knew that's how to have sex thing. before we had sex. No. No. But we were hot, so it didn't matter. We could just fuck it up, and who cares? We're we're pussy holes, you know. I bloomed when I was like 20. <laughs> Ever wanted a dildo molded from a specific dick? Yes. 
Yes. Yes. I feel like that's an excellent, excellent gift. If a For girl Christmas. really likes your dick. Yeah. Like every, I feel like every girl who's like really infatuated with a guy or a specific dick or like really likes the sex would love that. Yes. I had yes. a guy do that for me last year and like it showed up all fucked up and he's like, sorry, I tried. Because he probably made it himself. Yeah, he like made it himself. It was like Was it clay? No, there's like a, um, it's called clonal willy. You remember a clonal willy? No. It's like a, it like sends you like a mold maker. No, I should be. <laughs> I have a clone of pussy too, but it's dumb because it just clones your like vagina lips. It doesn't actually like, yeah. I would want like it to actually be like safely in there and then like my actual shape. So it feels like fucking me, not just looks like the beginning of me or whatever, that's stupid. But um, Do yeah. Do feel different inside from girl to girl? Yeah. Really? Yeah. It's all the same organ. Yeah, but like girls are tighter or looser and have like different well, yeah, like ripples like, in there and like. Yeah, every girl's different. This is news. How is this news? I don't know. I just feel like if you stick it in, if you stick it in a mouth, like you're gonna get a tongue and a roof. It's the same tongue and roof. I feel like that's more similar than than pussies, right? I don't so know. I think the same. Like I'm like they're just, you know. I don't know. God, I'm ignorant. They're definitely different. I always ask. I'm like, am I tighter or looser? Did she feel tighter tired? or looser? Is different. Yeah. Like I get that, but I mean, like the walls of a vagina. Can a man tell? Mm -hmm. Like, would Hunter be able to stick his dick in you and then know that it's you versus any other girl in the world? Depends. I think. Without touching you or well, smelling the, you or anything. But like, then there's still the tightness. I, I don't know if their dick feeling is as intricate as like being able to be like, oh yes, you are ribbed this way or whatever. But I mean, you would know which dick's going in you probably. Like you would know out of like five guys which dick it is, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I don't know. That's a dick. I don't know. We're done. This is even the question. <laughs> this is even a question. Would you watch your friend fuck? <laughs> <laughs> we, we may have already done that. <laughs> Ever suck on a guy's dick with another girl? <laughs> Oh, I love these. Okay, what's hotter, sloppy, slutty BJ's or the moment eye contact, or moment eye contact? Sensual or in the moment. Oh, in, in the, the moment. moment. Okay, yeah. So sloppy, slutty, or in the moment eye contact, sensual blowjobs. What's hotter? Hotter? Yeah. Honestly, in the moment eye contact. I feel like I combine the two. I don't know if I've ever done just like, I don't know, I feel like I do both, but I feel like I have like the, the aggressive fuck me eyes. If I'm doing eye contact, not like, like oh my god, <laughs> I don't know, like sensual. What is sensual? I, I get sensual fucking, but I don't know about sensual. I think fuck me eyes is the right term. Yeah, but then fuck me eyes is kind of slutty. So you're saying there's the sloppy slutty is like just fucking. You're not looking up at all. You're probably That's going you're fast, like, and you're just like <laughs> drooling on it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. So there's no eye contact there because you're just like going hard. I think no matter what, eye contact is gonna be hotter. Yeah. Even if I like the sloppy slutty stuff better, the eye contact just always will push it over the edge for like making it hotter for sure. Because vanilla, how do you two know each other? We talked about this in the last video, but uh, yeah, she used to fuck my boyfriend. Hey, hey. And then we met at an event, and we started. Started talking and we clicked. I don't know. We clicked, right? You mm -hmm. feel like we? Cl I feel like we clicked. Yeah. And now I like her a lot. She's a cool chick. Very cool. What? It's telling me I've been on Instagram too long today. That happens. <laughs> I, yeah, I have it set up so I like don't mm -hmm. sit and fucking scroll all day. You know. I didn't even know it was possible. Are you down with Oro o Omo Rashi? What's Omo Rashi? Totally girl. Something I actually don't know. You have to look this up. Fetish subculture originating and predominantly organized in Japan in which participants experience arousal from having a full bladder or wetting themselves, wearing a diaper, or from seeing someone else experiencing a full bladder or wetting themselves. Yo, I used to be like really, really, really into watching guys pee when I was younger and it's still translated over to now and like, I love being peed on and stuff. When I, no, when I was younger, I actually wanted to like trap a guy in a room yeah, like that, I'm just so I I love that shit. So yes, but like the diaper thing, no. I don't want anything that like simulates like old age or young age. I I don't like any of that. Like mm -hmm. the daddy dom little girl stuff. I'm not really into that. Like I could get into a little bit of role play of that, but like the whole like actually making it realistic is like not my thing at all. Like I would never want to be like, oh my god, daddy, I got a full diaper, and then he's like, oh, I'm so <laughs> I'm mad at you, spank you, like oh no. Or like being like, oh, you're so old, <laughs> daddy, <Yeah>. why? <laughs> Wrinkly balls, yes, no, thank you. But I like having sex when I have to pee, like that feeling of- Yeah, that feels really good. I don't think it's the same for guys though. I don't think guys like that. I think it like detracts from the horniness. Like, I've, asked a, I've asked a couple guys and I think they say that it like detracts from the horny. For me, it's like, it's almost a similar feeling to being horny, you know? Mm -hmm. Like needing to pee really bad, so. Sometimes I can't tell the difference. Like, yeah. Do I have to pee or should I masturbate? <laughs> I'm gonna masturbate and then I'll pee. <laughs> 
Yeah, and then sometimes, like, if I'm, if I'm, like, trying to, like, not, if I'm trying to not be horny anymore, you know, I'll be like, well, let's see what happens after I go pee, then maybe I'll be all right, you know, like, mm -hmm. it's, like, it's, like, the same thing. I've, I think it's different for guys. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments, but I think it's different for guys. Is waking up a woman with oral sex as effective as it is with a man? Um, I feel like that's a little bit of gaslighting, that we should do that more often. Like, I feel offended. Yes. I've never had that happen, ever. <laughs> ever. Ever. It's been years for me, but that's always really nice because you're sleeping and so you're already normally when you sleep you'll you'll produce a little bit of wetness. Yeah. Right? From our dreams or whatever else. And then so I don't know, I just feel like then they go down there and you're just like first waking up and it just feels really wet and it's like like the first feeling you have in the morning, which normally is like anger towards an alarm or whatever else. Anger yeah. towards an alarm. And then you can be like anger toward your fucking partner giving you head. Yeah. That sounds nice. I like it. I don't know, dude. I have I have morning sex now. I used to never have morning sex or like morning blowjob. I don't think I, I've only done it like a few times waking a guy up with it. It's always just like, do you want a blowjob in the morning? It's never like, yo, let me arouse you from your slumber. I've only dated guys that get really angry when they're woken up. <laughs> like honestly. <laughs> You get punched in the face. <laughs> They're literally get like, away from me. I'm tired. I'm not interested, man. You know, it's like that. Like literally like that. So I think that's probably why. And then like, I'm a light sleeper. How would you get in between my legs before I'm already awake? Like you get up to pee and I'm like, where are you going? I'm awake. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> no, I think it's still, even if you wake up during them trying to like get down there. Yeah, because you're like so, rousing yeah. a little bit. I'm like, oh, hi. Yeah, it's nice. I like that. It's nice. Relationships must be nice. Relationships must be nice. Like someone and possibly getting head. Giving. In my situation. Giving and getting. <laughs> the two. The two. Do you still like to pleasure yourself despite a fun and good partner? Yes. Oh my god, are you gonna say no? What? Um, I'm smoking. <laughs> I was I was doing seeing if I can get it in my nose. I was looking at myself. <laughs> no, dude, okay, so like Mm, let me see. How can I? There's nothing better than my 2 p.m. masturbation, which Tara ruined today. Wow! I did uh, do it this morning. We could have taken a break for this if this was <laughs> that important to you. Like 2 p.m. I'm so horny. Like it's clockwork. 2 to 3 p.m. I will always please myself. He's there, willing to fuck you. You will still want to masturbate at 2 p.m. Why? I just want to do it really quick. <laughs> can you watch? Can you watch? Yeah. Yeah. Interesting. I might evolve him actually, but so do you like masturbating better than getting fucked? No, it's just this this fucking midday jerk off you guys. Am I the only one who does that? Like it's just like every day in the middle of the day I get just horny as shit. That's probably no, the horniest like, I am all that day. That happens to me too. Yeah, that's why I don't like when you get into a routine where it's like morning and night. I'm like, mm -hmm. well, like well, that's why I like the young. weekends. I'm like, oh yes, the weekends, whenever I want. Like who cares? Oh, uh -huh. yeah, but like. I used to do it, but it was because I didn't get enough sex. Like I would always prefer sex. Yeah. And now I don't, even though I still don't get enough sex, in my opinion, because like we got a weird, we got a weird thing. Busy. Well, we got a, we got, we got like a weird dichotomy, you know? Like I, I like being told what to do and like waiting, and like it's like hot, and I don't have very much self control. So like it's nice to try to build self control by like looking forward to something, you know? Like I'm not very good at that. Like I, I used to previous to my current partner, I would be like, yeah, like I'll fuck you even if I shouldn't, or you know, like. I'm a, very, I'm a very bad monogamous and very bad like telling myself no with the like food and sex and everything It's just like so I want to I want to build that and I also like being told what to do so I don't it's funny I was like what what so you don't masturbate? No, well, I but I, I like adding in masturbation to like sex or like mutual yeah. masturbation I really like I like watching porn masturbating and all that stuff but like with someone you know that makes it more fun I have on my phone I don't know if it like still works but I had like this video that I would always go back to if I was going to masturbate alone that like and I wanted the specific thing that I like I think we talked about this before like um guys jerking off or whatever mm -hmm. and I'm gonna show you I'm gonna see if it works let's see if it works I found this because I like downloaded my my notes from fucking uh, cloud, iCloud mm -hmm. and I hadn't done that for like ever. So let's see if it works. Oh my god, the moment of truth. It still works. It's like a girl jerking a dude off or something, I think. He's got a nice dick and she just like jerks him off or whatever. It's like always tailored toward like gay, you know, when it's a solo guy. Yeah, like it's really hard to I find love, a guy. I love, that's what I masturbate to. Just guys solo? Guys jerking off, yeah. Yeah, 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 same. So like, for the past year, like, that. and I haven't switched. You still only do it. I know you're telling me like switch it up sometimes. Or you get like in a mood or whatever. Yeah, yeah. For me, it's that's always been like the hottest thing. But like I've talked about it so many times. You guys know. But like 
just something about the voyeurism of like being able to watch someone in their natural habitat doing their like very private thing is just like super hot, you know? Yeah. And like a guy pleasing himself or whatever. And I'm like, oh, I want to know everything and watch every time. This is so hot. You know? <laughs> <laughs> That's the best. So yeah, I'll still like masturbate and I'll still come from masturbation, but not like alone. Not like actually alone. I'll like sometimes do it as like a tease where I'll just be like, Haha, ha, wait and watch me, you get nothing, you know, and mm -hmm. do that or whatever. I'll like do half the job myself, you know, like play with your clit when you're getting fucked or whatever. But <clears throat> never like, I and I do get horny in the middle of the day. It's annoying. Also with my like job, you know, cause you're like being sexy. Yeah. You know, and like that can like, be like a turn on. Yeah, so I'm like in <laughs> work and I'm like, God damn it. And I'm like, ah. And yeah. you don't act on it. No, I don't. Was that the last question? That might've been the last question. Let's see. Let's I'm see. also, I've been single for two years, so it's different. Like you're in a relationship, so maybe that's it? I don't know. Yeah, I mean, I wouldn't fucking, what would I do? I'm single, like wait a week sometimes when I can't get dick, like fuck that shit. <laughs> so if you never got you, sex- You gotta wait longer than that most of the time. <laughs> oh my God. What? You have like, you have fucking like three or four fuck buddies, don't you? One, consistently. And then the other ones I try dating and then it doesn't work out. So why does the one try to, why does he make you wait? He gets busy. He gets bad when I, if I like make out with somebody, he won't make out with me or just see me. Oh my God, that's rude. Because God forbid my tongue was in someone else. He's like, I'd rather you just jerk him off. <laughs> but can you then use your hand to jerk him off after you've jerked someone else off? He just thinks it's gross. Any fluids are ever swapped. What? So you can jerk him off. You just can't swallow the cum that comes out. <laughs> Oh my God. Let's see, is there anything else? Let's do a last one, because I know I skipped a couple. What is the most number of people you've ever had group sex with? Group? Yeah. Like threesomes? Oh, in, in one setting? Yeah. Two, so for three. Three is the most. Three, three like and you? No. So two and you. Two and me. Two and you. What, same. Like, I've done like sex in the same room as people, but like no swapping, no like fucking yeah. or whatever, and that's probably like up to five max or something. But there yeah. Was, there was an additional? <laughs> I've had me six. Okay, okay. <laughs> I was like, two couples, one's just going back and forth. One's just fucking, yeah. Like, I got the anal shit. Or just like masturbating in the corner, whatever. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you, know, it's, you know, sometimes it's that kind of day. But yeah, no, I've only done like threesomes. Why? Why are we lame? I thought I was gonna get some good ass number from you. <laughs> you are lame, wow. It's my vanilla trait right there. Not enough group sex. How many threesomes have you had, like, groups? Like, let's say if you did it a bunch of times, that only counts as one with the same people. Two, two. Who else? <laughs> <laughs> um, it was a, a, a lesbian and a male. What? And so it was all about me. <laughs> wow. <laughs> it was fun. <laughs> I would do it again. <laughs> oh my God. Wait, so the lesbian was like, okay with, did she get fucked by the guy or was she like, stay the fuck away from me? No, she got fu fucked a little bit, but like she was married. <laughs> to a woman. They were getting divorced. Oh. <laughs> separated, maybe. They were separated, I don't know. She was really cool, she was really pretty. It was a Christmas present. Oh yeah, you told me about this. Mm -hmm. That was like your first one? Mm -hmm. What? Yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> I was like, this is fun. <laughs> Oh my god, this was like a, this is an interesting perspective now, I thought you, forgive me for thinking you're a huge slut. <laughs> At least in this way, because you get along with girls so much, so I thought like any, like you'd have a lot of opportunities to do that. I had a lot of opportunities. Younger, I was against threesomes. Really? Yeah. Why? I don't know, because I'm a really jealous person. Oh, really? And I was always in relationships, so if I'm gonna have a, a threesome, then that means... Yeah, you're bringing some rando in, that's... Right, and yeah. then like, that could potentially damage my relationship, so I just was always against it, and then, since I've been single for like two years, I, I was like, you know what, I'll be the other girl, shit. Yeah, it's, <laughs> I think it would be fun to be the third, yeah, because like, it's less, like, it's more like, who gives a shit on your end, you know? Yeah, like, you get to go home alone at night. <laughs> <laughs> the best part. Best part of a threesome, we think, to go home alone. Yeah, like you get to leave the situation. You get to wake up at 6 a.m. and sneak out of a condo. I woke up and there's condos literally all windows. <laughs> that sun came up, I was like, no! <laughs> I'm blinded, I have to go. And I look that at the mirror and like, my hair is just like... for like an hour. Oh my god, I... <laughs> I woke up too and I was like... <laughs> Where am I? <laughs> oh my god. Not okay. <laughs> Not okay. I felt bad throwing away all that pizza, to be honest. Like, it was, it looked Why would so you order delicious. That much? I don't know, but. I'm hungry, I want pizza. I know, I know. <laughs> I'm in the mood for some pizza. Is this how all your YouTube videos go? Just 
<laughs> yes. yes. Off I track. Can, I cannot stay on topic. I, I'm literally the worst rambler and you are too, so it's great. I'm the worst storyteller. I don't know why you're having me on here. No, you're actually a good storyteller. You are. Um, you like, you set the scene. Yeah. From the last video, if you guys haven't seen it yet, go watch it. <laughs> I think that's it. Unless we want to lick, licking pussy of each other and peeing on faces. I mean, we could be... <laughs> <laughs> we can fit that into the video, right? It hasn't been that long. Jeez, like what do people think? What do people think that I'm like, I'm making a video, they're like licking pussy and peeing on faces. Specifically faces too. Like if I was to like pee on your leg, it would like not be enough for this guy. Yeah, it had to be face. That's sad. We were doing stuff on OnlyFans, link in the description. And also her fucking Instagram link and shit. Go follow her. You need to post more on Instagram. No. No. <laughs> I don't know, what do I post? Yourself. Sitting at home every single day. Yes, you're like day one of my my sad life. <laughs> just like day so boring. I'm like, back. it's me again. Just fucking dress up cute and take pictures of yourself. Why not? Dress up cute and I'll come over and take pictures of you. Okay. <laughs> hey, it works. We love you. I love you. I, I can't speak for her, but I feel like she loves you. I don't know you. She still loves you. For but, sure. uh, yeah, I love everything. Yeah, she loves everything. <laughs> I mean, she loves nothing. Don't listen to her. She's evil. Goodbye. <gasps> Look. Oh, cool. I like how I did that. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>